Namaste, welcome to Sisrekha's Kitchen.com. Today I am making spicy tomato mint chutney. This is a nice side dip for idli, dosa, upma, pongal, etc. It can also go with rice or chapati. To make tomato mint chutney, I have taken 5 to 6 tomatoes and cut them into small pieces. I am cooking them on medium heat along with 4 green chilies. You can use green tomatoes or red tomatoes or you can use both just like I am doing here. To these tomatoes add some salt and some turmeric powder. Give this a stir. Cover it and cook on medium heat for about 2-3 to three minutes. After 3 minutes add a big handful of mint leaves. I picked up these mint leaves freshly from the backyard when I am picking up my tomatoes. Continue cooking for 2 more minutes. After 2 minutes give this a stir, add cilantro or coriander leaves, switch off the flame and let it cool down while we make the tempering. To make tempering, take 1 tablespoon of oil in a small saucepan and heat it on low medium heat. When the oil is hot, add 4 red chilies and fry them until they just change their color. Transfer them into another plate. To the same oil, add 1 tablespoon of urad dal and 1 eighth teaspoon of fenugreek seeds. Fry them until they just turn light brown and transfer them into the plate along with red chilies. Keep this aside. Now to this same oil, add 1 teaspoon of urad dal, 1 teaspoon of mustard seeds and 1 teaspoon of cumin seeds. Keep stirring. When the mustard seeds are spluttering, add hing or asafoetida and then curry leaves. Switch off the flame and keep it aside. Tomato and mint have been cooled down. Let us grind the red chilli, urad dal and fenugreek seeds first. After grinding them into a powder, add tomatoes to this. Now grind them together. But this time instead of making into a fine paste, just pulse it a few times so that it will be little chunky. Now you can see the chutney is slightly chunky. To this chutney add 1 4th teaspoon of tamarind paste and prepared tempering. Mix them well. You can refrigerate this chutney up to 3-4 days. Try this delicious chutney and give me your feedback. Thank you so much for watching my video. For more healthy recipes check out my website at sesrakhaskitchen.com and don't forget to subscribe for my youtube channel and like my facebook page